Robert W. Bridal Jr., uh, ENCSS. Oh, I was on three other submarines, uh, submarine tender, uh, submarine rescue vessel, and a 63-foot fishing boat. Uh, the Bang, I was on, the Clamagore, the Grenadier, the Gudgeon. The Gudgeon made her, uh, before I, long before I got on it, uh, it went uh, on a round-the-world cruise. Uh, I was the first submarine to do that. Uh, somehow it got forced to surface in Russian waters, at, and uh, that's uh, why they went around the cr world cruise. And by the time it came back, none of the crew was on it that left on it. Well, one, one of the submarines I was in A Gang, which works uh, the hydraulics and capstans, wenches, that sort of thing. And uh, the, another submarine I was on engine rooms, and then uh, the last submarine I was on, I was the 3M coordinator in charge of the maintenance of the uh, uh, system on the ship. I'd, I'd take and go through each department on the ship, uh, go through their uh, records, make sure they were doing all their uh, preventive maintenance, make sure that they had the right systems and, and were doing it. And that was sometimes a job because people didn't like to show you what they were doing. But, uh, and, so, and sometimes you found things that they were doing that they shouldn't be doing. But, <laughs> the, uh, one of the chiefs that was a uh, senior chief uh, torpedo man, he got all upset because I took his guy out and I was with him for two days going through his stuff. And he was upset and his second class chief, he did, he did great. He said he found two things that we were doing for preventive maintenance that had been taken off four years ago in the shipyard. <laughs> They'd been just signing it off and, and not doing it because they didn't have the equipment. So For a while the Navy, uh, for a long time, the Navy left people on a submarine for a long time if they wanted to stay. Uh, Woody and uh, Cromie were on the and they were friends of mine, both of them have deceased, but uh, they were on the boat six, seven, eight, nine years. Uh, and then the Navy started going around and they, you, they wouldn't let you stay on a, a ship a long time. And they found out that uh, they lost a lot of information. You know, guy, guys on a ship only three years, they go through one yard period, maybe two, uh, where the guys, on the last submarine I was on, we're on there 13 or 14 years, went on as firemen and, uh, or second class, and uh, two of them were master chiefs when I knew them, so, and they'd been on that submarine for 13, 14 years. So.